uh, today we'll be uh, uh, going through the steps of uh, creating a small icon here. When you click, you'll uh, mute the uh, 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 whatever the sound that is playing. Uh, so if you uh, click it again, that is going to toggle on and off. So I find that uh, very useful. Uh, although I don't use I I don't use the icon uh, here. Uh, but I will go ahead and go through the uh, steps to uh, to how to create a, uh, this very useful uh, uh, icon. So I'm going to show it on uh, Jamie Pup32, which is a uh, Puppy Linux 32-bit uh, 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 ISO, but it should work in any Puppy Linux. Um, so the first step, uh, what we want to do is go ahead and start a uh, a terminal and we'll take a look at the uh, uh, control of a mixer and this uh, should be uh, installed in all uh, puppy Linux so when we go ahead and uh, click on it it gives you some information that uh, there is a PCM that it, uh, controls the uh, 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 the sound so presently is the uh, front left and right um, and the percentage of sound and etc. So more <coughs> more accurate is probably uh, just use uh, soft control, software controls, and then uh, it'll give you the uh, uh, the key um, a word, uh, which in this uh, uh, my setup uh, presently is a PCM. The other common uh, uh, control is master. So depending on what you need uh, what we need to do is go ahead and uh, get a a mixer command of set s s e t or uh, s e t also works but uh, we'll go ahead and get a pcm and then uh, the keyword here is toggle so it will toggle uh, sound and no sound so um, we'll go ahead and set we won't uh, We'll set that up, and then also uh, we'll go ahead and start a uh, um, uh, dead beef. So you c I hope you can hear the sound. So we'll go back to the uh, we'll go back to the uh, and then I'll click it. So here's the sound that uh, is mute, and I'll click. Uh, I will bring it up, and we'll click it again. So we have confirmed. So we have confirmed this uh, uh, command is the correct one for my uh, uh, machine. So that's what we need. So you can see uh, on the icon uh, on my test bar uh, that uh, there is a uh, uh, mute uh, signal. So if I just unmute it again, watch the uh, icon. So, um, Okay, so that's uh, that also gives you a visual clue as to what state that your uh, your sound uh, setup is. So now, if you're uh, at this point, if if you're like me uh, and you do not need a desktop icon to toggle sound on and off, what you can do is just uh, uh, what my preference of just opening uh, opening up a JWMRC dash personnel file, which is under root dot jwm uh, uh, a folder just simply open that up and then what you will have is uh, uh, toward the bottom here uh, keyboard uh, section where you can uh, put in a uh, keyboard shortcuts with for various uh, uh, commands and I just added uh, in my case uh, key mask equals uh, a uh, alt key uh, equals I just simply uh, just uh, with the ALTM uh, key will activate a mixer set PCM toggle so, and then uh, you just simply uh, enter that uh, once you confirm that's the correct command so some of you may be here is master uh, toggle so for my uh, setup is PCM toggle and once that's saved what you can do is just uh, um, go to uh, 
jwm-restart command and that's gonna uh, read a uh, new configured uh, file so and then it should be active so then you simply uh, whenever you w wish to uh, deaden the sound or music or, or YouTube uh, video that is playing you do not wanna hear the sound all you have to do is ALTM and then you'll mute it and you can see that uh, the toggle the mute work works now and I'm gonna push an ALTM again and it uh, changes so it verifies that indeed that uh, that works that with a key okay now we're gonna go into uh, how to uh, uh, conf uh, set up a desktop icon now to create a, uh, a desktop icon uh, uh, what we need to do is go ahead and uh, uh, create a, a small bash script so uh, that we will first uh, go into root and my app applications and bin folder because this is uh, uh, whatever you put in here it will be in path so we'll just go ahead and enter that and then next is what we can do is just uh, create a uh, a file uh, toggle mute sh so we'll just go ahead and do that first and then there should be a uh, so toggle mute sh file. So next, what we need to do is uh, make it ex ex executable. So with uh, chmod plus x toggle uh, mute sh, you just simply uh, uh, tab it uh, to complete the uh, uh, the name of the file, and then we'll go ahead and. So now it's uh, executable. Now what we have to do is load that, uh, load that in up into Genie, and uh, it's actually already uh, loaded. So uh, what we need to do is go ahead and put this uh, uh, shebang here, uh, exactly where the uh, uh, way it's written. And then next is go ahead and uh, put in the same command. So a mixer set um single apostrophe pcm toggle and uh we can run it in the back uh, command can be in the background so uh some of uh, you uh or ma most of you perhaps um, uh, sh it should be master so here so but uh, anyway you go ahead and save it and then to have this read what you need to do is go ahead and give it a command of jwm restart and it will read the uh, new configuration file so we'll go ahead and do that and then we'll go ahead and close and then so this is going to have to make sure it's saved so it is saved now so next step is to go ahead and uh, um, drag it out of the desktop so we'll go ahead and uh, find that file which is under applications so and then it should be under bin and then we'll go ahead and drag it out toggle mute sh okay so we'll go ahead and drag it out here maybe we'll just drag it a little bit more in the center okay so we'll go ahead and close it and then just to test it what we'll do is go ahead and uh, start uh, uh, dead reef again and then uh, right now you notice that it's uh, it's uh, mute so we'll go ahead and ALTM just to get the sound so and then we'll go uh, drop back into the toggle mute SH and we'll click it so now the sound is dead we're gonna click it again so now it's back. So that indeed works. Okay. So what we uh, next step is to go ahead and uh, uh, perhaps change the uh, uh, icon. So what we can do is go ahead and go to the uh, uh, 
let's see, toggle mute and set icon. So under toggle mute sh file, so uh, set icon. And then what we have to do is say find an icon that we like. Um, there may be a, a, a speaker uh, type of icon in uh, Puppet Linux, but I, I think it's just easier just to go ahead and uh, start up a, a browser and then we'll type in We'll type in uh, speaker mute icon and see what's uh, available. So I have a, a rather slow machine. So there's uh, a lot of images available. So we'll go ahead and take a look at what images we we'll like. And maybe we can just use this one. Uh, so we'll go ahead and right click and see if we can save it. Save image as. And PNG is fine. We'll just change it to mute. Um, downloads. It's probably easier just to go ahead and put it in uh, under uh, root. I do have dot icons. Uh, under root folder so we'll go ahead and put it there and then we'll have to change the this uh, mute PNG okay that's fine we'll go ahead and save and then we'll close this browser and it's downloaded so what we can do is we can go ahead and edit item again uh, edit uh, set icon and then point it we'll open up the rocks and point it to the uh, icon uh, which is right here and then a mute where is mute well, I didn't put it in uh, uh, icon so here's the mute so what we'll do is just drag it and move it to icons and then we'll uh, go in there and then mute and we'll just drag it in to drop it into icon so here's the icon so we do have a uh, uh, icon okay so next thing uh, is probably uh, rather than clicking it every time you want to uh, on and off you may find it easier just to use a keyboard command so we'll go ahead and right click on it and uh, this time is edit items and then here you can go ahead and uh, for example I'll just use a uh, control M this time and then okay so now I c without even clicking the icon if I enter control M it should mute this background sound so we'll go ahead and start the uh, uh, now I'm gonna uh, enter control M so now I entered the control M you can see it here I'm gonna uh, enter control M again so uh, so this obviously works globally so it will uh, uh, if you're playing uh, YouTube or whatever in the background it'll uh, 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 mute so I hope this is helpful and uh, uh, interesting for you